Watch this seat. It lowers by itself. Coming to my flat. This is my bed sit. The house we're viewing next is just a few minutes drive from the vineyard and I think its modern finish really belies its rural location. Built in the 80s, this detached single story villa has been completely renovated over the last five years in a style I'm hoping will appeal to Joe. It's got a great living space, three double bedrooms and some sleek modern bathrooms. Outside, it's got a lawn garden and a full-size swimming pool. It's on the market for more than 20 grand under budget at £272,000. This is our second house, guys. What do you think of it? It looks nice. Obviously, we're away from the sea. But oh, we're near the vineyard! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the the sea of wine! <laughs> Very yeah. comfortable, don't you think? I think on this property is the price because it's on for two hundred and seventy-eight thousand pounds. Nothing new in the kitchen. <laughs> so there's my toilet, and there's my dining room, and my living room. Now the garden. Now, tomorrow, we'll have some pictures to show you. But on top of that tree trunk, that's an our bird feeder. All the uh, turf has been taken out by the flower boxes and all those bricks I have used to make my lovely wall. I need 10 more bricks. Uh, Terry's uh, rockery in a corner is really nice. And she uses her greenhouse. You want to uh, knock down that shed and have a big one. And we took out all the flower boxes from there and extended the, the beds. And all these have got plants too, which is in front of the decking. Now, what I'm more proud about, you can't see it yet, but under the tree there is a African bamboo wood chime. I don't want to walk on the lawn because it's wet and I've only got my slippers on. But that's our centerpiece, this area. We've got ornaments and hanging boxes and hanging pots on those tree trunks. And that's Willow and tell me, is she, is she thin? Because we starve her now. She eats 46 grams of her, of her, look at her, look at her, fast she moved, see that? Uh, well, so I'll take you into the lounge. Right, that's my lounge. I'm gonna knock out. And find a fireplace. And I've done mostly, we haven't finished the stripping wallpaper. But this is now our lounge. Not a very nice room. Now, look at this. This is, makes you sick. Look at how big holes just there. 
one big hole there and another big hole there and a tiny hole somewhere along here it's not very pretty and ants were pouring through so I had to use that and that anyway So, pro work in progress. What else? Yes, let's go and show you where I put all the clothes that, and all the stuff that was under there. It's upstairs. Yes, and there it is. isn't it? All organised. All our coats and our scarves and gloves and bike gear. Oh there. All nicely put aside. And it's lightweight. You can easily move it around. Look at my garden from here. Very quiet. Very quiet area. Neighbours are okay. Uh, happy I moved. Just a bit tired now because I'm not feeling well. Nothing else to report, everything else is the same. Oh, yes, and there's a TV in the bedroom. So I'm gonna go to bed and I'm not gonna show you the TV until I look at it. I'm on the bed and now I'm gonna turn around. Turning around, and there it is. Down there is a Blu ray. So I sit in my bed, watch my 40 inch, and it doesn't take up too much space. See the cap? Okay, right. Bye bye.